I'm gonna head on towards the mountains. Two days ago we had uh, quite a bit of snow on the mountains because uh, on a weekend, last weekend, we had a bit of snow falling down. Uh, they were covered uh, even two days ago with the snow. It looks like everything melted since yesterday uh, we had a pretty hot day. It was like uh, close to 30 degrees. Uh, all the snow is gone from the mountains again. I love that uh, to see that pictures. Even though the mountains, uh, they look beautiful with the snow on, but uh, I love my fall time. So that's too early for snow. The view up front is uh, quite spectacular today. Again, lucky. Another good choice of a day to go for a spin. So we are getting into Black Diamond. Time for Timmy's. So there we are, coffee time. Now I can continue after the coffee. So I made my plan, I'm gonna head out uh, towards Kananaski's country again. Uh, that's about uh, 60 kilometers from here now. It's the foothills of the mountains. So that's a pretty common motorcycle route that uh, guys from the uh, surrounding area of Calgary taking uh, for a quick spins. Uh, they usually either run through Kananaskis or head out uh, straight towards uh, Chain Links uh, Provincial Park, which I did uh, in my other videos. It's a fun place to ride around here because you get a few hills, a few turns. It makes it not as boring. I want to thank uh, to all my viewers and subscribers that are subscribing to my channel and uh, making it uh, grow little by little. Uh, every subscriber counts and uh, comments are always uh, appreciated. I try to get uh, answered all of them. And uh, guys, that, uh, any subscribers, that's uh, always a uh, big milestone for me. Uh, probably the same as other small YouTubers, uh, starting YouTubers that uh, starting out and uh, they want to get their channel to grow and uh, get it exposed out there. Uh, I do have fun making those videos even if I don't get a subscribe, that's a given. But uh, of course it's always nice to uh, have a payback uh, at the end of it uh, because after all we spent some of, quite a bit of time uh, making those videos uh, then editing them and uh, putting them out there for you guys to watch. Uh, I do get some views, I, I really, really appreciate that. Uh, that's a, that's a tremendous help uh, on the channel. Uh, you guys, are a lot of you are watching, but uh, don't ignore it, subscribe. Don't be shy, uh, like myself, when I'm going through YouTube content even, and I see something I like and something that at least helped me in some way or get me some joy when I watched it, I do subscribe to that channel. There's no harm in it and uh, that I know that always helps the person that's uh, making that video. Uh, I know how YouTube works uh, and uh, for sure that person appreciates it. I know the big guys probably don't care uh, like if you, they have uh, thousands of subscribers, uh, sometimes I even ask a, qu ask a question on the channel and they won't even respond. Uh, they got the views, they've got the subs, they don't care anymore probably at that point. They, they might answer only a few questions if you're the first one to pop the question on, uh, on a video that they put out. Uh, you might get some answer, but uh, if the list is goes on and on and on, uh, don't count on it that you get answered. But uh, for all you small YouTubers that are watching, or even the guys that are watching it, and uh, you know, if you get something out of that video that I put out, 
don't be shy and subscribe I know I do um, uh, dual content on my uh, channel uh, there is a little bit of scuba diving there is a little bit of uh, motorcycle riding uh, but uh, the reason why I did that uh, I call it YouTube uh, channel scuba travel and adventure uh, so I don't have to maintain two separate channels and uh, it's, uh, there goes quite a bit of work, believe it or not, into those videos and uh, to maintain the whole channel. So this way uh, I can put out uh, videos for the guys that are scuba diving and also the videos that are um, riding. And uh, like I say, if you like those, that content, don't be shy, subscribe. And uh, if you like that video, don't be shy to hit that like button either. So I started the channel uh, beginning of this year basically I had the channel for uh, longer but uh, I was not never thinking um, to uh, to go somewhere with it basically I was just putting the videos for the hell out of it but uh, after watching some uh, YouTube and uh, how people can grow their channel and uh, they can even make a living out of it that uh, kind of uh, put uh, the light on my head and uh, why not if since I'm doing it anyways might as well get exposed uh, exposed uh, publicly this is where I made my video uh, about all the accessories uh, one of the first videos that I put on the channel uh, about the accessories that I put on my Honda Africa twin by that uh, pump the oil pump that's the finest Canadian oil out of Alberta support that we need that oil uh, business here uh, that keeps the province strong and the government is putting so many loops on that so I'm getting near Kananaski's country now you can see the mountains are being closer now so closer and closer and I don't think I'm gonna go all the way into it uh, I just did it uh, I don't know last week uh, I was there with my buddies today is another solo ride it's a uh, weekday it's a Friday so most of the guys are at work so I decided to go by myself anyway don't want to waste a good day like this and a good weather not to go on a bike ride and now it's a good time since my daughter is in school so otherwise uh, if I head out uh, the wife is complaining that uh, the daughter is home and uh, she wants to have uh, you know some entertainment happening uh, on her side so I get it I get the point uh, that's all about uh, being a good father uh, taking care of your child and uh, taking her to places so she can see the world as well can't wait today maybe maybe next year she's gonna be able to ride with me hopefully uh, she has to be able to reach the rear pegs and right now we're still short by the few inches so maybe go I'll go up this hill here see what is out there I never went on that road uh, it might be okay let's have a look it's a gravel fun Last time I was passing by that uh, exit, I didn't stop. I should have. That's looking actually pretty cool. No traffic, awesome. That makes it even better. That looks like it's a pretty cool farmland. I think I have to pull over here. It's a nice Kodak moment. <laughs> 